my name is Laura. This is my channel Laura's Little Library and welcome to today's video where I will be setting up my home library. I'm so excited the time has finally come so as you saw in an earlier clip the bookshelves are here and they are put together they are set up I am going to be unpacking all the books and getting them in some sort of organization on my shelves I really like how I organized my bookshelves last time I was a big fan of that so I'll probably do something very similar I fell in love with these shelves. I love the dark wood and the metal. It gives like a nature dark academia vibe, which I adore. That is something that is right down my alley, nature and academia. And I felt, I thought this would be very fun to decorate for the different seasons and everything. So how I have them set up, and yes, they are already nailed to the wall, because I wanted to get that done. <laughs> um, so we have one, all the way in that corner. They're like double shelves. It's one unit, but it's kind of like two shelves with a divider in the middle. And then there's space here. And then there's another one. Same idea of kind of two shelves, but one unit. And I have the space in the middle here because I kind of want this to be the cozy reading area. So I want to get a chair, blankets and pillows. I already have plenty of blankets and pillows, but I need a cozy, chair and I might get a lamp or something too. I don't know. We'll see. Maybe some cool light thing. The possibilities are endless. And so I'm going to set it up as a little cozy reading area in between the two shelves, which I really like. But then at the same time, if I get enough books that I need another shelf, I can put the shelf in between the two and they're, they will be nice and together and it'll just be a wall of shelves. Last time I had the equivalent of three shelves, slightly less than three shelves, but I have gotten quite a few books since then, so really these four shelves should be enough. They should be fine. And then once I have all these books set up, then I can finish with the rest of the room with the writing desk and everything like that. But now let's get started on the exciting parts. I will mention that I am listening to an audiobook. I am listening to The Man Who Died Twice, which is the second book in the Thursday Murder Club by Richard Oseman, I believe it is. Hi Donatella, hi sweet girl. Um, so that's what I'll be listening to as I put together these shelves. Of the boxes of books have been unpacked. They are very loosely organized with this close to the door being like my fantasy, my thriller, academia, like just kind of all my favorites, mythology based, etc. and so forth. And then this over here having Histor like fairy tales, historical fiction, contemporary romance, manga, other older series, international, classics, and yeah, some of the older series. Um, I don't really know where I'm going to put middle grade at the moment, and this could still definitely change, but I kind of like the idea of the setup, so I'm going to keep working. And yeah, hopefully I can get this somewhat done tonight. And then when it's all set up, I'll give you a brief overview. And then I will probably do a bookshelf tour early next year. Okay, bookshelf update. This shelf has officially been turned. 
so that all the books are upright. The decorations are not permanent at all. And I don't know if I like having them like right at the edge here or if I want to give a little space consistently and then I can have decoration. It's just because there are no sides that I feel like having it right up is more stable and is closer to looking neater but I really like that I can reach up top there that just adds an extra shelf of space and that makes me so happy but yeah I it's mostly organized not completely organized I'll probably reorganize the shelf or two but I'm trying something new with my contemporary and doing it by theme rather than rainbow so like I have all my baking ones dance ones and then you know it leads down into other stuff but so that's the update. I flipped all these books and now I'm gonna go to the other shelf and flip all of those books. And then once I understand how spacing works, I can do a more finalized display. Okay, so update. All the books are on the shelves. I've officially pushed them back a little bit so that there is space there so that I can put my decorations, which I'm really excited about. I've done some new additions. I've done a little bit of rearranging. I might still play with it a little bit though. So I'll probably rearrange them a little bit more before I do like a uh, bookshelf tour for the beginning of next year because I typically do bookshelf tours at the beginning of the year just because I'm always moving. So it's always different. But the exciting whole point about this update is right here. We have a chair. And Donatella has decided that she would display it for us. Nope. Okay. Oh, hi. Hey, sweetie. So, I, fun story. I had bought a chair. I had bought, I had bought a chair. Um, and then almost immediately, my husband goes and finds this chair. And it's perfect because it match. It's like the dark brown of the wood and of the desk, which is a mess. Like, so it's all kind of matching and coming together but it's not all dark because like the tbr cart is still white so there's still that to go with the walls but it's very dark academia so i love hi hey. hey. we love how dark academia this is starting to feel it's pretty great um so i'm, I'm really happy with this chair actually because i can be in any sitting position in this chair and read and it's right by an outlet, so I can plug in my electric blanket, especially for reading in the winter. And it's right by my books, and it fits the space really nice, because I can have that there. And there's even room right there for, like, a lamp, too, which I've been thinking about getting a lamp or something in here. So, yeah, we are almost done. I really just got to clean up this room a bit and get the last finishing details, and then the book room will be done. Done. so we're almost to the end of this vlog so that's so exciting also I will say I love this pillow I got it and I was like I don't know where I'm gonna put it probably in the book room but this was before we bought the house like I bought this last year and I never had it out but again it matches everything perfectly so there's also that yeah <laughs> Sweetie pie. Hey. Update. Oh no, I'm I'm filming. <laughs> <laughs> so we got this lamp and I moved it from downstairs to upstairs because I think it looks really great in here. And then Brennan is putting up some of the decorations in here. I'm so excited. And then once we have the decorations and do some final cleaning, this room will be done. That's so exciting. So there's your little update. Hopefully it'll be done this weekend. We'll see. <laughs> okay, y'all. It's almost completely done so I'm just gonna say that it's done the only thing we have to do is to hang up that poster onto that space there but the shelves are put together the chair is here the decorations of what I'm gonna have by the chair for when I'm filming for my other channel are there 
I have a light to read by when it's dark. It's very dark academia. That lightens it up quite a bit, but I am okay with that. And then the other shelf is also all set. So this half of the room, it's also complete with cat. Hi, Bubba. And so this half of the room is the book room, is kind of the library, and it is set up complete. I might rearrange the books slightly, but for the most part, it's done. I'm super happy with it. The other half is still the more office side where we do our homework and where I work from home. But this is officially done. So. Yeah. 